Welcome back to my channel. Today we are asked to solve for the value of x in this particular equation. Okay, first, anytime the variable is the power, the only way to get the value of that variable is by introducing log or a length to both sides of the equation. So let's introduce log to both sides. So if we do that, we have log 4 to the power of x is equal to log 40. All right, I want you to recall that log a raised to the power of b is equal to b multiplied by log a. So we will write this as x multiplied by log 4 is equal to log 40. Now, Let's divide both sides of this equation by log 4. Divide both sides by log 4. So if we do that, we have x log 4 divided by log 4 is equal to log 40 divided by log 4. Please click the subscription button and turn on the notification bell if this is the first time you are seeing this amazing face and this amazing channel, all right? Give us a thumbs up if you actually enjoyed this video. And if you are a returning subscriber, thank you so very much. And please tune in at your convenience. There must be something new for you to watch by the grace of God. Thank you very much. All right, now let's continue. So, log 4, we divide itself. We have 1. 1 times x is x is equal to log 40 divided by log 4. Now, I want you to note that 40 is equal to 4 multiplied by 10. So, we'll write x is equal to log 4 multiplied by 10 divided by log 4. But log a multiplied by b is equal to log a plus log b. So write x is equal to log 4 plus log 10 divided by log 4. Now to get the value of x is actually easy. Okay, so many of us can do that. But the most interesting aspect of this video is where I proved that the answer I got is correct. So I'd like you to watch to that part so that you enjoy that place, okay? All right, so here we have x is equal to, remember that when you have a plus b divided by c, that it's equal to a divided by c, plus b divided by c. So, we can write this as log 4 divided by log 4 plus log 10 divided by log 4. In case you can't see this well, I'll repeat what I just wrote here. So, I wrote that x is equal to log 4 divided by log 4 plus log 10 divided by log 4. Now, when log 4 divides itself, we have 1, okay? So, we have x is equal to 1 plus log 10 divided by log 4. Please ignore the shadow, okay? Thank you. All right, now note that 10 is equal to 2 multiplied by 5. So we have x is equal to 1 plus log 2 multiplied by 5 divided by log 4. So we also apply this rule that log ab is equal to log a plus log b. So we can write this as x is equal to 1 plus log 2 plus log 5 divided by log 4. So we have x 
is equal to 1 plus log 2 divided by log 4 plus log 5 divided by log 4. So we are almost there. Almost there. So have you given us a thumbs up? Yes. If not, if you're actually enjoying this video, please give us a thumbs up. Okay. Thank you very much. So this is what we have. That x is equal to 1 plus log 2 divided by log 4 plus log 5 divided by log 4. Okay? But 4 is equal to 2 squared. X is equal to 1 plus log 2 divided by log 2 squared plus log 5 divided by log 2 squared. So we have x is equal to 1 plus log 2 divided by these two. We come down to multiply log 2, right? Plus log 5 divided by this. We come down to multiply log 2 as well. All right. So we have that x is equal to 1 plus. Now log 2, we divide itself and we are left with what? Half plus. This we have half log 5 base, log 5 over log 2. Okay? So I'll repeat what I've written here. x is equal to 1 plus half plus half multiplied by log 5 divided by log 2. But log A divided by log B is equal to log A base B. So we can write x is equal to 1 plus half plus half log 5 base 2. So let's solve this, all right? So the LCM here is 2. The LCM is equal to 2. So we have x is equal to, we have 2. When 1 divides 2, we have 2. 2 times 1 is 2, plus when 2 divides 2, we have 1. 1 times 1 is 1, plus when 2 divides 2, we have 1. 1 times two, uh, log 1, log this is same thing, log 5 base 2, right? So in essence, our x is equal to 2 plus 1 is 3, plus log 5 base 2 divided by 2. Now, this is the value of x. Let's find the, let's uh, check to verify that the answer we got is correct. All right. So the equation says that 4 to the power of x is equal to 40. So 4 to the power of our x is 3 plus log 5 base 2 divided by 2 is equal to 40. Now, recall, but 4 is equal to 2 squared. Okay? So, we write 2 to the power of 2, bracket, 3 plus log 5 base 2 divided by 2 is equal to 40. Now, remember that a raised to the power of m to the power of n is equal to a to the power of m multiplied by n. Therefore, we write 
2 to the power of that means this can divide this to give us 1 1 times this will give us the same thing 3 plus log 5 base 2 is equal to 40 now recall or remember that a to the power of m plus n is equal to a to the power of m multiplied by a to the power of n so we can write this as 2 to the power of 3 multiplied by 2 to the power of log 5 base 2 is equal to 40. There is a, a law in log reading that states that a to the power of log b base a is equal to b. So 2 to the power of 3 is 8 multiplied by, so this and this, they are the same, just like the law I just stated. That means the whole of this is 5 is equal to 40. So we have 8 times 5 is 40. So you can see that 40 is equal to 40. And that proves that the answer we got is correct. Thank you so much for watching. See you in my next video. Bye.